in collateral d we have uh, three main uh, lines for example the outlines that this is outline and the outline can create a pattern uh, like a polygon rectangle and other thing here and another thing we have internal line that for example if you want to cut in for cut a hole or uh, for sewing a pocket on this t-shirt you can use the internal line another line is baseline that i will explain the difference between baselines and the uh, internal line that uh, can change the topology i mean they can change the <clears throat> polygon if you draw it, the difference between them and the trace lines uh, to explain them one by one the second main line is internal line for example if you want to um, create a pocket here you can uh, in the uh, create internal line the internal line you have to uh, draw them inside the pattern for example you want to create a line here that you can after that string something to that you can do here you can uh, exactly like before in a polygon you can draw a line here click 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 or before clicking you can right click you can choose the length you can activate a mirror if you want in the y-axis that you want as you can see exactly like before exactly like the polygon and you can then click and close the line this is an internal line and as you can see we have a symmetry here and after that like before you can edit it in any position that you want you can double click to select it and delete it this is a polygon internal line here you can select a rectangle or uh, as before you can click and uh, select the size uh, replicate it and choose a position inside if you want <clears throat> uh, for editing you have to edit uh, click and edit pattern you can uh, click and drag it and as you can see for simulation we need another simulation <clears throat> And as you can see if you go to the polygon if you draw the internal line as you can see the topology and the polygon will be changed okay but if you draw a baseline here as you can see the topology and the mesh does not change here yeah I'll explain them more the, the main difference between baseline and the internal line if you draw a internal line it's one of the feature one of the uh, line of the topology of the pattern and it will change as you can see if you click and drag and insert the internal line oh this is a baseline as you can see the topology does not change but if you click and drag an internal line everything will change <clears throat> okay here you can go to the uh, texture okay if you go to select pattern if you select all of the it's very uh, easy you can uh, do, go and transfer point you can uh, add a curvature for example if you want you can add a curvature here exactly like before you can refer to the previous lesson for uh, explaining the polygon and <clears throat> any comment and anything that you can do with the outline you can do in the internal line okay uh, at the point split it at a smooth scale anything that you want double click to select it and you can simply uh, create an outline and a pattern of this internal line right click on it and uh, another thing that you want to explain here you can convert to the hole as you can see you can cut it and delete it copy log here you can clone it as a pattern i want to create a pocket here okay you can convert it to the baseline you can cut it you can cut and sew it but i want to uh, clone it as a pattern and as you can see if you click and click and here we have an um, another 
uh, object here. Okay. We create a pattern of that uh, baseline, the internal line, and we can zoom into each other. For doing that, you can simply go into the switch segment and in a 3D, you can click, click, and swing each other. And then simulate, and here you can create a pocket here if you want with the internal line. Okay, so we're using internal line for uh, doing such these things pocket uh, or uh, for creating a stitch and sew or anything that you want. That's, we have to create a product to understand it better. But exactly every comment, everything in a outline and uh, creation, we have in internalized selection. But if you click and drag it outside of the pattern, please click within the pattern if you want to create internal line. Exactly on its name, internal line. You can ellipse and you can add a dart that I explain it. Uh, here you can add a hole with a dart mode here. Uh, and uh, and it's automatically soon as you can see it's at a dart for tightening the pattern that's very explain more which is dart inside or you can um, go here select the point and right click and we have it at a dart at a notch that you want okay so this is an internal line that you want to use it Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.